but grief remains. West Country holidaymakers have long been able to cross the Tamar River by railway. Motorists, however, have had to use the ferry across this river that divides Cornwall from Devon. But this will soon be obsolete, for a magnificent road bridge on the right there is expected to be open in November. It's over 30 feet wide, and its central span of 1,100 feet is only beaten in Britain by the bridge across the Firth of Forth. The new bridge will be a real boom. So will the completion of the new Banff Jasper Highway in Canada. It offers wonderful views among the Rocky Mountains. Bear and moose are plentiful and only too happy to be shot by the camera. A pretty rugged countryside implies hard work hacking out a highway. At one point, they're building a steel bridge over 300 feet long. It will cross Nigel Creek 200 feet above it. Quite a major job, apart from all the drilling and blasting for the highway itself. Tourist traffic is already going through, using parts of the old highway as well as the new. Motoring through the mountains in Canada. Here's something that can take a mountain in its stride. A new six-wheel amphibious load carrier, rightly called the Stalwart. I understand the War Office is very interested in this new Alvis product. It can cruise at 50 on the road and can deal with rough country like a tracked vehicle. The Stalwart can carry up to five tons and water is no obstacle. Swimming speed, five knots. Cab and cargo space, fully water sealed. This newcomer is certainly going places. <laughs> <laughs> 